All right, question number three for our podcast today is where can you find programs in rural areas? Now, it depends on what rural area you're in and whereabouts you are, but a lot of rural areas are going to have summer camps. So summer camps are huge, and I mentioned Pelham, New Hampshire back in the day. We had one summer camp in our entire town, and we would go there every summer. You meet a bunch of people, you get to have fun and hang out, go on lakes, which we've mentioned multiple times, and do a bunch of different arts and crafts and all that kind of stuff. So it's a lot of fun. But you may have heard of one thing, it's kind of a secret, it's called the internet. So <laughs> if you jump on the internet and look around, you're going to find a bunch of different programs. It might not be specifically in your area, and unfortunately, parents are working during the summer too, but if you have a bike and it's not too far away, jump on the bike, stay hydrated, and uh, make your way over to whatever the program is, because I feel like a lot of programs are usually not too, too far away. Yep. But if you're in the middle of nowhere in in Maine, for example, and you're saying there's not too much to do around there, oh. then... Um, <laughs> then you're like pointing me like Tuxbury. I'm like, well... So make no, a leg. No, no. Yeah, when you make a leg, visit the school up there. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I think that's really what I get anyway. I don't, you guys have any I mean, pro tips? Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, there's a lot of... I feel like when I think of camp, I think the middle of nowhere. Mm -hmm. But that could just be me because I didn't. I never went camping growing up because we lived in the city. We didn't do outdoor stuff. But um, nature, yeah. What's <laughs> nature? But Crash. I feel like there are a lot of, like you said, like just a lot of camp programs out there. I know the the Boy Scouts have a camp that's over by us um, in Bolton. Um, so oh, I've been there. Yeah, yeah. So like looking at like Boy Scout camps, Girl Scout camps. And, you know, if, even if it's like a sleepaway camp, uh, you can try and see if there are like counselor positions or I guess junior counselor positions because you have to be 18 mm -hmm. uh, for most counselor positions. So like look into like junior Save counselor positions money. where they will pay you to stay on camp. I was going to say campus <laughs> to stay at camp and just kind of work through the through the summer. That way you don't have to worry about like, oh, mom and dad need to drop me off, drop you off at the beginning, pick you up at the end. That's a good point, and you bringing up Boy Scouts is a great point too, or Girl Scouts. I don't know what the equivalent is in Girl Scouts, but um, being an Eagle Scout yep. is a huge deal, so you can use that to your college application advantage as well. What is the equivalent? Definitely. Does um, it brownie Eagle girl no. <laughs> Never in the Boy Scouts. I stopped after. No, Gold Award! Gold Award! That's it. <laughs> the Gold Award! I don't think I was ever that. Yeah, I, I never was, like, got a brownies. Gold Award. So, I, yeah, what happens ago? Yeah. Uh, it's yeah. Daisy, Brownie, yeah. Junior, Daisy. and I think it's Cadet. And then didn't make it that high. I did not make it that high. I went to a junior. I had the green vest, and that was a. Is um, cadet like one. the equivalent of Boy Scouts? Because you started for. Did you do? I never did Boy Scouting? Scouts. No. Any any scouting? I, nothing. You did like it's cool. like Cub Scouts. <laughs> yeah, it was Cub Scouts, right, but yeah. there's like different levels within yeah. Cub Scout. There's like start off as a Tiger Scout, you molt, <laughs> you like move up to uh, maybe maybe it's Bear Scout. And then, like, Weeblo, I think, is, like, the highest form of being a Cub yeah. Scout. And then... Weeblo? Weeblo. <laughs> I, I think so, anyway. That's how I remember it. I could totally be wrong here, but I remember the word We're going to have to, like, get a chart. I love the Girl Scouts. Yeah. Yeah, so for the Boy Scouts, the, like, highest achievement you can get is Eagle Scout, and you have to do a yeah. whole bunch of stuff for that. Exactly. For Girl Scouts, it's the Gold Award, and you have to do a whole bunch of, like, volunteering and stuff for that, too. Yeah. Um, so yeah, look into those kinds of programs. Um, they're available in your local YMCA. If there you are did, tons of locations. If you did like the volunteer work for like the Cub Scouts, could you like, well, I guess Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts, could you complement that with like your national honor society? You're asking way work? too many questions. I got no idea. No. <laughs> <laughs> I was not, so I was not that kind of Girl Scout. Anyway. If you had to do it anyway, it's a good way to do like your volunteer work. Yeah. yeah, exactly. I mean, how would they know? Someone called the Boy Scouts of yeah. America. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's not curious. wrong. Um, I saw you wearing that brown vest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're I saw your you. badges. I saw your badges. Yeah. Those don't count. You have to do another 130 hours of volunteer work elsewhere. Take off the yeah. ascot. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, going back to programs for the summer... I feel like if you're looking just for like a summer camp and you want to be like on the water or something, just like Ooh. look up a map and yeah. look for a pond or like yeah. I feel like they're bound to have a camp around there. I yeah. didn't really do the like uh, summer camps at the lake. I usually did um, like sports, like a week of a basketball, volleyball, like sports camps. Yeah, those are fun. Um, those are fun, but I kind of always wish I did like the fun like 
we get a summer camp, like stay overnight kind of thing? I fell in love with Camp Rock and wanted to go to a camp like that. <laughs> <laughs> Not even gonna lie. <laughs> but they don't have those for writers, or they did, but I was too busy working. Um, Can you imagine that? Like, but like a cool. writer's version? I don't even know how that I've would written go. it in my head like 10 times. Is it Camp Rock just like band camp? Yeah. Oh. Pretty, eh, well, like, not yeah, necessarily. No. It's like, yeah, it's, it's more basic. Singing. It's band camp, but not with the like school affiliation. Yeah, I don't think I, I, I would. One definitely would like to go there. Two would not like to participate. Three would just rather <laughs> be. A, would rather just be an audience member. He's and a watch watcher. Everything that <laughs> That's legit. Oh, for sure. Um, <laughs> uh, excuse me. I'm a professional shower. Shower. Be like, do you go here? Can I go here? I'm a watcher. <laughs> 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 Puts the sunglasses on. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm actually trying to be a critique. Thank you very much. Um, I'm, I'm trying to be a right. producer. <laughs> oh, that's good. There you go. That's me. Um, right. <laughs> you can also look at the programs aspect. that are like away but have a lot of scholarships. So we mentioned earlier the pre college programs at like Ivy League schools. They have so much scholarship because they're Ivy Leagues. <laughs> yeah. um, and a whole bunch of different places have those programs. So even if it's far away don't just like don't discourage yourself from looking into it because there might be options like grants and scholarships for you to get to those summer programs um also work is a program you can do in a rural area which is cool so <laughs> i feel like if you also do like the pre-college programs like mm -hmm. early high, in high school like uh sophomore and junior year yep. um it's a way to like get that connection with the school yeah. if you're looking to go to that school maybe go to one of their summer programs for yep. like three weeks yeah You'll get to know the professors there, too. Did you guys hear about yeah. that kid that just got his uh, degree from Harvard? Oh, like a week after, after graduating from high school a week before, yeah. yeah now he's going to law school. Oh, dang. Yeah. Didn't hear about that. <laughs> oh, yeah. So that's a thing. There's yeah. this cool. Do you know where? If you're super uh, smart. Uh, somewhere in Massachusetts, that much I know. Well, must be. Yeah. Right? Well, I guess he took the, the online programs yeah. at Harvard. But he was, um, I know it was somewhere in Massachusetts. Oh. That's what he was doing. I want to say something with the B. During the, su that's where he, that's what he was doing be. during yeah. the summer. He was taking, he was <laughs> like, college since, classes. since I think it was like, since like eighth grade or something, yeah. he was taking online classes at Harvard and graduated high school with it. Graduated Harvard and... Degree. High school. I've been taking them, I just not passing them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's you can do online programs in the summer yeah. if you want to do school. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing much. <laughs> this guy's going to fix the world. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, there's online so you programs. Can graduate like, from Harvard. <laughs> Go to Harvard during the yeah. summer. Yeah. Yeah. You Harvard. can just walk on the campus and just be like, I went to Harvard this summer. I went to Harvard two summers in a row. I didn't take classes, but I showed up there. <laughs> she yeah. showed up, knocked on their door, and they said no. I, I was at Harvard commencement like six years ago. For fun? Yeah, I was volunteering, but I was there. <laughs> it was fun. Oprah was also there. Uh -huh. I did not meet her. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, but for rural, you can still graduate from Harvard because the programs are online. So Use the interwebs. Online, the interwebs. Definitely the interwebs. They don't need to know. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs>